After rejecting the latest offer from Mercy Health's management, people representing the Service Employees International Union District 1199 took their signs outside St. Elizabeth and Boardman. 27 First News reporter Nadine Grimley has that story for us tonight. Outside St. Elizabeth Boardman, folks representing SEIU District 1199 are holding signs. They're calling for fair treatment and hope by picketing near the hospital, Mercy Health Management will see their point of view. We're out here protesting corporate greed. Um, this hospital, as well as others in the area, are owned by Mercy, and they're putting profits above patients. About 340 SEIU members have been working without a contract since August. And just last week, they rejected another offer at Mercy Regional Medical Center in Lorraine. Some of the biggest concessions that Mercy's asking workers is to give up step increases, which would de decrease their pay, increase out-of-pocket premiums by over $5,000 for their health care, uh, and a proposal that would have taken away sick time altogether. Although hospital representatives wouldn't speak with First News on camera, they did release a statement acknowledging the ongoing negotiations and say they are committed to reaching an agreement or lawful impasse. As for the protest, hospital officials recognize the union's right to picket but had a plan in place to make sure it didn't impact the safety and security of their employees and others in their buildings. Now Caldwell says that union officials and Mercy Management may be meeting again on Friday, but nothing has been officially set. In Boardman, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News.